From WFSB, this is an Eyewitness News update. Thanks for joining us. I'm Brian Treed. Here's a look at our top stories. State police are investigating a crash that killed three people in Weathersfield. The crash happened Sunday morning on I-91 near exit 25. Police tell us a tractor trailer was on the side of the highway when an SUV swerved and hit the back of the trailer. Several people had to be taken to the hospital that were in the SUV. 40-year-old 40-year-old Corey Watson, 32-year-old Lacey Price, and 36-year-old Rebecca Shute died in the crash. An investigation into a cause is now underway. In Norwalk, a driver has died after a single car crash. The driver has been identified as 37-year-old Joshua Chapman of Naugatuck. First responders say they found the car in an embankment off the roadway of the intersection of Grist Mill Road and the Route 7 connector. The accident is under investigation. Seasonal temperatures return early in the week, but there is a, even a threat for some patchy frost. A first alert for that Tuesday morning with some areas getting down uh, below even 37 degrees. So we will see the temperatures really turning around. It's going to be warming up to 70 on Wednesday, 70s for highs all the way through Saturday, then cooler Sunday. Right now we don't have rain in the seven-day forecast. It seems like a miracle. And shoreline temperatures will go from 60s to 70s by Thursday.